Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to Hades. I'm Avaritia, same guy as usual. Get me out of here. And today I'm going to be taking us through Elysium and hopefully all the way up to Temple Sticks. We will see though, because as you all know, Temple Sticks is a goddamn nightmare, and so is Elysium. Any fishies? Let's play some heroes then. No fishies. <sighs> Bummer. Um. Controversial. We're gonna talk to him. To Zeus. Jesus. Strongbows. Do you think that pronunciation is derived from Zeus? I'm curious now. I gotta. I gotta know. I wanna. I wanna sit down and, and talk to a linguist and find this out. Jesus. Uh. In the name of Hades. Uh. We will take that. That's great. Um, and we're going to go get the hammer because I would still like to pick up either twin shot or the other one I mentioned, uh, explosive shot. Sorry, Dan. Uh, that was super not show up. I'm really liking this run. I'm feeling really good about it. We're doing very well. Haven't died yet, knock on wood. Uh, which reminds me I should have knocked on some wood here. That's good. Better. Better. You guys probably couldn't hear that. I hope you couldn't hear that. Um, this spell could use a little fine tuning. Power shot's easier. Charge volley. Yeah, because I don't want anything that has to do with that special, because frankly, it's not very good! Um, go ahead and grab the darkness. I would love to fight Asterius. I really don't want to fight the butterfly. This isn't even the mini boss. There is a way you can tell if a chamber is the mini boss or if the chamber is just a hard room. Uh, if you look next to the skull on the wall, uh, the mini boss will have a little flag next to the skull under the uh, whatever the boon is. I'll show you guys here in a second. Who's next? That was not very cash money of you. I have a coworker that says that all the time. I'm like, I, I never. I started saying it ironically, and now he's just got me saying it to say it. And I, you know, I resent him for it. I love that man, but I resent him for it. Hey, you're not getting locked back by my attack. I don't really care for that shit at all. That one's rearming. I don't know if Spearman just can't be knocked back or what. Uh, okay, yeah. So you see here next to the skull on both of these, you see that little arrow pointing up? That signifies that this is the mini boss. So it's either Demeter or it's the Butterfly. Uh, we're going to go ahead and go to Demeter. And by Demeter, of course, I mean Asterius. And I chose poorly. It's that big soul catcher again. <sighs> Once again, as far as I can tell, the only use for that special is defensive. Even with upgrades, I just I don't see it being a, a, a feasible offensive technique. It's, just, it's not. The damage is too low for it to make any sense to use, ever. From an offensive standpoint, I, I just, it does not, it does not compute with me. And you know, if I'm, if there's something I am missing, let me know. But I'm pretty sure I'm, I'm correct on that. Uh, okay. Cold fusion. Oh. Oh, I like that. Yeah. It's exciting, isn't it? Uh, we're not going to go talk to Chaos, because this run is hanging on by a fucking thread. No. One thing I will say that frustrates me about this game is that the bounce on my bow is not consistent. It's sometimes... It'll hit three foes. Sometimes it just hits one or two foes. But whatever the case, it's just, it's not, uh, I can't rely on it. And that's frustrating for me. I, I like, I like, my, I like to be able to rely on my abilities. When it says it does X, I expect it to do X. 
That's just embarrassing. Can't believe I, I dashed right into that goddamn arrow. I don't think I dashed. I think I walked into that arrow. Nope. Okay, and maybe just like a quick two damage, okay? All right, there. Um... I don't... I don't see the... Are we good? We're good. Okay. <laughs> I had a little brain fart there. Sorry, guys. Uh, I really hope we run across Petrocles. I'd be very pleased if that happened. The butterfly. Of course we won't, because I actually need to see him. So, you know. Don't, don't hold your breath, guys. Understand how that man died. I'm confused. I assume it has something to do with the jolt damage I dealt to him. Uh, yeah, we're gonna grab the nectar, and maybe I should be grabbing more darkness. I don't know. I just I like the nectar. I think it's good. like to know who all these heroes are like you know it was my understanding that elysium is a pretty like exclusive club so and this is this is a slight uh continuation of a discussion a couple episodes ago i know maybe i shouldn't be doing that because expecting you to remember something from for what is you guys for what is for you guys two days ago is perhaps a little absurd but my question stands the, the, the basic premise of the, of the the question was you know how do these guys get these jobs? But now I'd like to extend it to, how are there this many heroes in Elysium? Like, how are there this many dudes that have qualified for Elysium? Seems to me like Elysium must be pretty easy to get into. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, and if it's just the same dudes over and over again, what the fuck is that? First of all, how are they trained in this many weapons? Something is just not adding up, okay? Something just doesn't make sense here. And I... Man, listen. One second, folks. Ah! Achtung! Okay. Uh, grab this. I don't actually know what Achtung means. I should probably stop saying it in case it's racist. Um, so, if that is offensive, I apologize. That comes from a place of ignorance, not a place of genuine malice. The magnificently ominous facade of the Great Elysian Stadium looms tall above the rabble-rousing prince, as if to goad him into such a competition which he cannot hope to win. Cheers for the vote of confidence, old man. <laughs> I love that they talk to the narrator. That's great. All right, folks. Good crowd, huh? You know it goes. See here, Asterius. The god-hated fiend is back once more to be destroyed by our joint righteous fury. God-hated. You'll have to be more specific. I have the gods on my side. Though, I suppose you do too. Why can't they make up their minds? They have made up their minds. They stand united against darkness, as do I. With the exception of Asterius here, who serves the light. Let's serve it now, my friend. To battle! There, demon! Come be in the open, fiend, or are you quite afraid? Most enthusiastic audience. So 
I think after this run, from now on, we're going to go back to the Acorn. Uh, because this fight, unlike the other ones, actually, I do care about how much damage I take. Since I have to go do Temple Sticks after this. For God's sakes. For God's sakes. Oh, no. Oh, God damn it. Oh, why am I so bad at this game? No. Return to hell. Oh. Okay, there we go. That was my friend. You and me now. Oh, stand and fight and quit it with your writhing there, Hellspawn. Huh. But given how few death we have, I think we will definitely switch back over to the, uh... Oh, hold on. Artemis Strength Mask. Uh, we will definitely switch back to the, uh, Acorn before Hades. Uh, because... Having just some free damage that I can just, you know, not... You know, just, just being able to take a few extra hits is gonna be huge. Especially when Hades does, you know, an upwards of 40 damage per hit. If he wants to. Uh, does not appear in this movie. Yeah, and now that we're down to no death defies, uh, it really isn't even a question. We we have to take the. Oh, actually, I might have to take skeletons too. Just in case I don't get what I need between now and. There we go. Good taste, motherfucker. So I expect us to lose this run. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and just gonna be completely honest with y'all. You may be saying, Abby, that's not very positive. To which I say, have you seen our HP and how many death supplies we have left? Um, Keepsakes hold power. But you know what? That being said, if I think we're gonna lose anyway, why even bother? Let's just let's keep with the to the, the butterfly. And the reason I'm doing that um, is because my thought process is we might as well level up the butterfly more, so that way. For each room that we complete without taking damage, we are getting 2% towards our damage instead of 1, and that'll help out in future runs. So, you know, we'll give that a shot and see if that helps. Could use the rod Yeah, fishy, fishy, fish, 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 fish. Chorp. Come on, chorp. Ah, scuffer. A scuffer. You may be asking, Abby, why do you want a Charp? And why do you insist on pronouncing it incorrectly? To which I say, I just like the name Charp. I think it's funny. Let's see here. Um, controversial. Hit me, David. Lost chain shot, gain triple shot, and relentless volley. Uh, that's fine, because chain shot really wasn't doing anything for us. We're going to go ahead and grab the HP. Maybe it's in here. Huh? Was Ares? Did you grab Ares in the last run, or were you rubbing on this run? I don't know. You know, like I said, I, I do these in like three, two or three episode batches, so they kind of start to run together after a while. Let's, let's... Hold the only time I think I've ever seen. I I, I regularly use the uh, bow for offensive purposes. Nice. Be really cool if this could just be the. Nope. That nope, for the record, was not in relation to whatever it was I was about to say. It was in relation to seeing the satyr and being scared. Oh, of course they don't give me a death to five. Why would they? Why would they? 
Damn you, Super Giant Games! That was a wealthy vermin. I don't have a call. That's very unchill. <sighs> That's quite a stash there, Charon. Business. Farewell. My plan to get a hold of you via the boatman worked out flawlessly. Harness the might of the sea, then why don't you? An exchange. All right. We're gonna go ahead and trade out for. No, no, this one mine, really. uh, Hades. Or not Hades. Uh, Poseidon's cast because it's much much better than Zeus's. Controversially, I said I said when I picked up Zeus's cast, if we came across Poseidon's, I would trade it out because I prefer Poseidon's much more. Um, it does not back; it does more damage. It's just it's just generally better. So I was I was very upfront about this, so nobody was surprised. I'm making this decision. Not now. Um. Be really chill if I didn't have to do the super asshole area of this dungeon. I, I really don't want to. I've explained how this works before. You know, it's the Seder sack randomly spawns in one of the five halls. Maybe it's four. I don't know. Math is hard, guys, okay? My brain says I need 200 HP to get on the rest of the five, but it might be 400. I really hope that I'm remembering correctly and it's actually 200. I'm out. Hold on. Come over here and grab my soup. Wait, where the fuck's my soup? God, they are... They are just blue-balling me on this one, aren't they? God damn, okay. Well, go here. Frankly, I've been incredibly lucky, and I have yet to have one where I have to do literally every single one of these rooms. God, that's, that's real chill. I need to focus on the game as opposed to looking at my phone while playing Hades. That'd be that'd be smart. That'd be intelligent. Come on, well. Although, you know, this, this might end up being the one, because, uh, we're three deep now, and I still haven't found it. I think you can stop me.
this for you, boss. It says, it sure is nice up here upon this mountain, not having to escape the underworld. Come join us soon, won't you? Wish I knew who that was from. Uh, specials faster, side hustle, grab sweat strike. And I don't suppose there's a little char in here, is there? No, no. Should be able to get no soup for Abby. No soup for Abby. No boost there, huh? I could have swore I didn't take any damage, but all right. Really? Three for three. No, no dice, huh? Wow, that's incredible. I've never seen that before. I'm blown away that all three of the ones that I found did not have. Yeah, wow, that's, that's crazy. strength all right let's do this we're gonna go fight hades i don't uh, fuck man i don't think we're gonna win i'm gonna try i'm gonna i'm gonna do my best but i don't think we're gonna win should come in useful as you can see by now we are a big and clever family little hades my niece athena here being the cleverest of all you'd never know that she was childless the way she looks after and cares for all of us surely my cleverness comes from your brother and yourself lord uncle poseidon and I would only add, my feeling is we've more than enough children in this family. Thus, no further need for more of them for now. Oh. <sighs> We're gonna give this a shot. That might, that might be really good. I don't know. Just what I need. Oh, that's great. <laughs> okay, well, maybe we will win. I don't know. I've never... That's a lot of duos in this round. moves for no one. But for Satus Axe, he can make an exception. Good boy. Oh, yes. Fight for now, boy. All right, folks, here we go. Here we go. <sighs> Deep breaths. I believe in us. We got one one chance. All right. Do not miss a this chance to it. blow. Because opportunity knocks once in a lifetime. You know now what you're doing here is without any purpose whatsoever. Even if I don't slay you myself, you'll simply perish when you cross that threshold there. And yet you still persist. I do. Besides, hey, I'm recording, right? Trex helps pass the time. Yes. During the ongoing underworld renovations, and I'll be in tip-top shape once they're complete. Would that we had a little more support. The renovations could have been complete by now. As ever, you think only of yourself. But if you must insist like this, then you will find me waiting for you once you get here. Every single time. Here's what I don't get. If Zangrius is guaranteed to die every time he reaches the surface, meaning eventually he'll be back, why does Hades continue to try to stop him? If his motivations don't make sense, I'm confused. Maybe there's something here that we just haven't uncovered yet, but there's something here that just doesn't quite jive with me. Oh, good job, Abby. Wasted effort. Darkness. Oh, that's right, Shell. Ha! 
Suck my bow, Dad. Such contempt for your own father. But we are not finished here yet. That does it. All right, well. Blasted little. Oh, oh god. Teddy's got the doom laser stuff. You know, I wouldn't mind a little bit of Hermes movement speed right about now. Oh, that didn't break very many at all. You're not my real dad! I don't want to die! <laughs> oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Fuck. Pray for me, Tiki. Me your energy. No! I told you, boy, that there is no escape. <laughs> oh, we were so close. Ah! <sighs> oh, that sucks. I'm very upset. Oh, that sucks. Damn it! Oh, we're so fucking close. Uh, well, folks, that's going to go ahead and do it for today. Thank you so much for tuning in. Remember, if you enjoyed the video, to like and subscribe. If you do subscribe, of course, remember to hit that uh, bell icon so you are notified every single time we go live. Hades goes live every single day, 10 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. Thank you so much for tuning in. We almost had him! Thanks a lot, and remember to love each other. Bye-bye.